VidGem includes a dedicated branding layer that mixes your logo animations at specific intervals in both standalone and live performance modes. First, you need content. Images will work, but this feature really shines with logo animations. If you're interested in 3D logo animations compatible with VidGem's BPM engine, jump over to Motion Logos and launch a new project. It only takes a few minutes, and you can submit as many projects as you have logos all under the same account. A few days after your project was launched, hundreds of custom animations will be ready for review. From here, click to select the ones you would like rendered in HD. A few days later, your animations will be ready for download. Note that several of these templates contain a beat grid that can be read by VidGem for syncing your logo animations with your stage, streaming, or post-production tempo, in the same way you can beat match all your other visuals in VidGem. This is huge for DJs, bands, and anyone else looking for synchronized production because it means that even your logo branding will be in sync with your music. Now that you have logo animations ready to go, let's dive into VidGem's branding layer. First, place your logo animations in a new folder on your hard drive. Launch VidGem, open Settings, then navigate to the Logos and Branding tab. Browse and select the folder you've just created and activate the branding layer by ticking the Auto Play Logos box here. At this point, the layer is active and VidGem will mix your logo animations according to your settings here. After the time specified in the Frequency field, the first logo animation will mix in and continue playing for the duration time entered here. The transition in and out time can be adjusted here. Then the process repeats for the next logo animation in your folder. Sound confusing? It's actually not. Just think of it this way. If you want to rotate between all of your logo animations every 10 minutes, change this value here to 10 minutes. If you want each logo animation to play for 30 seconds, then change this field accordingly. If you want very short cuts in and out of the logo animations, set this value to a low number, like 1 second. Or, if you want the logo animations to fade in and out more gradually, set it to something higher. If you're in BPM mode, all time-related fields throughout VidJam will change to beat notation, so you can set relative to the current tempo. For instance, if I change to BPM mode, I can set this field to display my logo animations every 64 measures, and keep each one in the mix for 8 measures, with a transition time of 1 measure. When active, a new timer plays in the duration area of the base layer. This indicates the time to mix in and the time to mix out of the current logo animation in queue. This dedicated branding layer is a great way to automatically insert your logo animations throughout your sessions. Simply place all your logo animations in a folder, choose your settings, and activate the layer.